Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I'm showing you how to make apple glazed roasted pork loin. This is one of my favorite ways to roast a pork loin. It is so delicious and so simple. To start, you'll need a two to three pound roast pork loin, and you can see that mine is tied up. You can just ask the butcher to do that behind the meat counter, but you don't really need it. Tying your roast will make a more rounded oval shape, while an untied roast will lay a little more flat and rectangular. So it doesn't really matter if it's tied or untied, it just changes the look, not how it cooks or the flavor. Next, you wanna season your roast with salt and black pepper and make sure you get both sides. I use about a teaspoon and a half of salt and half a teaspoon of black pepper. Then we're gonna take this over to the stove. Get one tablespoon of olive oil heating in a large heavy skillet that's oven safe. Then we're gonna get the roast in there and start searing it. You're looking to sear the outside and brown it off. So make sure you continue to rotate it so that all the sides get browned. Now I don't neglect the ends either. I'm gonna stand this up on its end to sear both of these end pieces as well. Once it's all browned, we're gonna remove this from the heat and set this aside for just a second. We're gonna brush a little apple cider Dijon mixture on top of it. So we're gonna whisk together two tablespoons of Dijon mustard with one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. And then we're gonna brush this onto our pork loin roast. Then we'll slide this into a 375 degree oven to finish cooking. It'll take between 30 and 40 minutes for your pork to reach an internal temperature of 145 degrees Fahrenheit. Use a meat thermometer to ensure 100% accuracy. This roasted pork loin is delicious just the way we've made it, but I like to make a little sauce to go on top. We're gonna start this apple glaze by melting two tablespoons of butter in a saucepan over low heat. Once the butter is melted, I'm gonna add in a tablespoon of cornstarch and whisk that in to form a little paste. Give that about 60 seconds to cook, and then you're gonna pour in one cup of apple juice. We'll also need one tablespoon of Dijon mustard, one tablespoon of brown sugar, and a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar. Whisk this in. We're gonna increase the heat to medium high and continue whisking this until the glaze starts to thicken. You can see after a minute or two, our glaze is ready. If we check on our pork here real quick, you can check the internal temperature, and it's 144 degrees, which is perfect. Pork needs to be cooked to an internal temperature of 145 degrees Fahrenheit. Let the pork loin roast rest for about five to 10 minutes so that that internal temperature will continue to rise and get above 145 degrees. Once it's had a chance to rest, you're ready to slice. Serve it up hot with that delicious apple glaze. Thanks for watching. You can find the full written recipe in the video description. Be sure to subscribe, like, and follow, and check out the rest of my videos where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. See you later.